like you to meet a man who was the model for almost every rock and roll performer during the 50s and years thereafter. A true rock and roll legend. Ladies and gentlemen, meet the greatest, Little Richard. <laughs> Why is it, Richard, after 26 years in the business, you're as big, if not bigger, than ever? What's the secret of success? I think it's the, because I've been really doing it. <laughs> you know, the, the Bible says, you shall know the truth, and the truth shall make you free. I've been free. You've been an honest man in your I've been work. an honest man. Been broke, but honest. <laughs> <laughs> Do a little name dropping. You headlined the show when the Beatles and the Stones were little boys and knickers. That's right. I met the Rolling Stones in the back of a truck. Mick Jagger in the truck singing himself away. I met the Beatles in Liverpool with Brian Epstein. He brought me there. Oh, His record funny. shop did. That's unbelievable. You're, uh... Does it bother you when somebody says you're a rock and roll legend? I even said that in the introduction. It makes me feel good to know that I've been a part of something that is growing and won't stop and got, got a living root to it that has been planted and can't nobody take it out and it's down there. <laughs> when did you start? How young were you? Ten years old. Do you think it, it, it makes a lot of difference to start when you're young being a musician? I think so, because I hadn't started plucking in. I don't think I'd be plucking now, because I would have been with the rest of the fellas. Everybody else stopped plucking and started doing something else. Are you the only musical member of your family? I'm the only one. All the rest of my brothers holler, but I sing. Did you ever work with Stevie Wonder anywhere along the line? Yes, I worked with Stevie years ago, uh, Dick. I uh, played uh, Washington, D.C. with him when he was real, real young. And I was the only time I've been nervous in the business because I had to go on behind Stevie Wonder, <laughs> you know, and uh, he's, he's one of the greatest. 